Good morning. One of you asked me how um, how I edit and uh, record and all that kind of stuff, uh, my videos. So uh, I figured I wanted to make that video today. As you can see, I'm recording in the mirror now. And that is because I want to show you my setup here, my uh, camera and uh, what I use. It is, it's actually only my uh, cell phone I'm using. And uh, the cell phone is a Huawei uh, P8 Lite, it's called. And uh, well, yeah, it's it's a Chinese cell phone, the Huawei, but uh, it's it's working very good. It's uh, I bought it not too long ago, and I'm very happy about it. Then I have this here, and that is a well, I guess it's it's a mono monopod. It's not a tripod. It's just one leg, and can be made longer than it is now, but have something to hold on to and also so it's a little more steady when I use this so uh, let's see if I can you can see it's it's this long right now I only folded out one part of it it's telescopic it can be uh, longer so that's the yeah and then I forget I got this clip uh, screwed onto it so that I can put the the cell phone on the on the monopod, and also I got one on my tripod. Down here in this box, I got my my action cam. It's a Rolei, and um, it's okay. And then I got it mounted on a strap so I can use it as a head cam. Put it on my forehead maybe you see in one of my uh, videos and then I got some other different cables and connections and stuff um, yeah. flashlight and camera mount for the action cam and yeah you know all kinds of stuff and actually down here in the bottom that is my own I bought one of these uh, external microphones and I made a windsock for it. That was before my friend let me borrow his one. So, uh, and it's it's working fairly good, this windsock. Here you see my, <laughs> my workstation. <laughs> Basically it's just my laptop computer. And uh, it's an, an old uh, laptop I bought second hand from a friend, so it's nothing fancy and then a mouse I don't know I can't use these uh, touch thing for a mouse I want a real mouse power supply for the laptop you see the cable here here and then go into this a small inverter um, actually an adjustable inverter I can set to different settings and then I got the cable running behind the cushions and all the way over here and this here is quite a setup <laughs> well this this here can connect three um, what do you call it cigarette lighter plugs and it's connected into this one and this one's connected in onto the battery the the battery is under the sofa then also here I got the inverter that I uh, my friends gave me for my birthday, and uh, this inverter I use when I run my big laptop, watch movies and stuff like that on the big laptop. Most of the time when I watch movies in the evening, I just use my small tablet. Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, there we are fairly cheap Lenovo uh, tablet and then I got the bag for it because well traveling and or living in this way and it's will get some beating and and it's good to have it protected normally I have my 
laptop and my tablet in this bag and it's just laying on the sofa and it stays there it's never been any problem and it's kind of padded this bag so it protects my equipment well when i want to edit a video of course i uh, recorded on this phone that i'm recording on now so i can't show you how to transfer from the phone to the laptop but that's pretty simple just connect with a usb cable and, and that's it then i put the files video files in this folder called youtube <laughs> yeah i got four video files that i'm going to make into a video down here i got my intro and my outro that uh, i use for all my videos for an editing program i'm using Vegas Pro 13 takes a little while to open. Oh, there you are. That is my editing program. All right. Well, then it's just a question of drag and drop. That was my intro and the first file. The screen when I'm editing and you see then it's just a question of finding the right place to to cut just listening and looking uh, probably set it there and done that and then again drag and and drop and so on just And then continue like that, editing the the whole thing, making it the way I want it. And uh, time consuming, yes, it sure is time consuming. And especially when I use my action cam, because the format on the recordings on the action cam does not... Uh, match the the editing program so I have to change the the format first in a program that's uh, also some software I got on my laptop to change uh, format and uh, that takes a long time so if I'm using recordings from the action cam that's the first thing I need to do change the format then I do the editing and then when I finish do the editing, I need to, it's called render. Um, the easiest way to explain that is if, if you uh, imagine that the video is, when you start, it's like one piece and then you cut it in small pieces. And then before you can put it on YouTube, you have to glue it back together. This is kind of the the old fashioned way if you would do it obviously it's it's done digital on the on the laptop but then it's called render and that takes a long time too uh, the last video i put up was uh, a bit more than half an hour and it took me four and a half hour to render and for all that time the laptop has to be on and running and well that's a long process and also while it's rendering my laptop's not strong enough, so while it's rendering, I can't do anything else on the laptop. So uh, then my uh, tablet comes into play. Um, obviously, one of the reasons why I bought the tablet is for exactly that, but also because the tablet takes a lot less energy than the laptop. So when I'm uh, using the laptop, it uh, has to be plugged in and uh, well if I'm using it for an hour so it's no problem it can be I charge it in forehand and then I use it for an hour and that's okay but the laptop can only run for uh, an hour an hour and a half then the battery is flat then I need to plug it in and charge it again so uh, if it if it's going to uh, render for four and a half hour, it needs to be plugged in and I need sun to, to charge my battery while it goes on. 
So you see. Um, so that's why, as I say, that's why I bought the, the tablet. So I can watch Netflix and YouTube and stuff like that on the tablet and answer comments and, and stuff. So, um, but yeah, that's basically it. it the, the whole um, recording, editing process, it is something that takes some time. Um, it is time consuming and, uh, but, but I find it, uh, I find it interesting when I finish the whole process, recording, uploading to the laptop, editing and, um, rendering, then obviously I need to, uh, upload them to YouTube and, uh, internet. I'll show you my internet thing. My mobile internet, I use this thing. It's uh, actually also a Huawei, uh, it's called a mobile Wi Fi gadget. And uh, here, got the SIM card. And uh, then I just charge this thing and, and it connects to the, to the internet. So I can upload and stuff. And on this one, I use a company called Oyster. And on my cell phone, I'm using a, another company called CBB. And the reason why I have two different providers is because when this one has no connection, sometimes, you know, I'm outside uh, where there's coverage and, and stuff. But when this one loses out and don't have connection, most of the time the cell phone got because it's two different providers so that's uh, that's the way to do it I think my uh, internet thing a lot of times I put it up here and I think putting it up high helps on the signal if that's not enough I got another place to put it and that is here in the window you see, they got Velcro, and I put Velcro on the back of the thing, and then I put it up here, and that makes the signal better. So uh, that's the that's the internet part of it, and I would say my hundred gigabyte a month only just enough. I am thinking maybe I need to get more internet. Um, there is a company in Denmark that provides unlimited for the cell phone and I don't know if I can use that um, on this on this thing I have to find out about that so um, it is different than in the States because over there you got uh, I know you don't use uh, SIM cards most of the time we do here in Denmark so uh, so it's uh, a little different. Anyway, that's basically the video recording, uploading, editing, and uploading to YouTube. The whole process. And yeah, it takes some time, but it's okay. I like it. So, that's it. Just a video about that. I had a question, now I answered the question. But before I leave, I want to show you just where I'm parked today. I was uh, boondogging here in this spot last night. And today I'm gonna spend some time editing a video and just hang out here. And then I'm gonna go to uh, Helsingør. I'm gonna meet a friend, uh, my friend Bo uh, in Helsingør today, or tonight. So, uh, but uh, let me show you where I'm parked. So, of course, near the water. It is early morning, and I don't think a lot of people is awake. 
because it is a public holiday today. So, uh, but yeah, that's that's my spot. Very nice spot, but cold today. It's hoof. Go back inside. It's too cold. So that was just a short video about well about how I make my videos. So you guys take care and you see life is good. Bye bye.